heart rate monitor, which is built into the back, and then also show you how the uh, fingerprint sensor works. So we'll start first with the uh, S Health and the heart rate. Basically, you launch the app, tap on heart rate, and it kind of gives you a tutorial. Basically, just says put your finger on the sensor on the back, don't move or talk while you're doing it, and uh, it'll calculate your heart rate. So I'm going to do that and try not to talk or move, so we can see if we can get an actual reading here. So you just place it right over the sensor. So there's my heart rate apparently according to uh, the Galaxy S5. So that's how that works, built in there. I think that's, this is the first phone to ever have that built in, which is kind of cool. Um, so if we look in or at the, uh, the fingerprint sensor, now this is, uh, it's been set up for somebody else, but I just kind of wanted to show you guys how the whole process here works. So there's a fingerprint scanner section in settings, fingerprint manager. Now you can use this to pay for things with PayPal and stuff like that. And basically what you're looking at is at the bottom, you swipe from the screen over the entire button and then it's supposed to uh, read. So if you just swipe over, um, and you can see it's, it's not exactly working for me. Swipe faster. Swipe entire path. No match. So there you can see it was set up for somebody else. So it's not going to work for me. Anyway. That's how you do it. Um, it's sort of, we've had those sort of issues with it the whole time. So uh, pre-production though, so that could get tightened up and work better uh, in the future. So anyways, just want to show you guys those two uh, features that are uh, supposedly standout features for the Galaxy S5. Droid life. Peace.